a short helicopter ride away. 7,100 feet above sea level is Dyer Mountain. Here, PG&E crews take snow measurements. Well, PG&E measures the snow within our hydro watershed so we know how much water to expect for hydropower. Trekking through the snow, they survey 10 different spots. We'll get a sample of the snow and then weigh it, and then you can determine from that basically how much water content there is in the snow. They first drive the tube into the snow. Then they measure the depth and weigh it for the water content. We got a pretty good amount of uh, water content in the snow and it's going to look like a pretty great year. This year's snow depth on Dyer Mountain is averaging 96 inches. That is about 33 to 42 inches of water, which eventually will be used for hydropower. The snow right under our feet is going to melt and eventually work its way into Lake Almanor and then down the North Fork of the River, Feather River into Lake Orville and then eventually into the Sacramento River. And the snowpack on Dyer Mountain is up 15 inches from last year when there was just 81 inches of snow. We're certainly happy to see a very healthy snowpack, one of the best we've seen in decades. The data collected will also be shared with the state to get a better picture of what the water situation is in California. Christina Davies, KRCR News Channel 7.